Wakey, wakey. It's time to get up. No, I don't want to. You have to. It's a bright day outside. The sun is out. It's a great day to be alive. I just want to sleep longer. Mood. Ah, don't be like that. Here, I know. Let's wear something cute to lift your mood. Wear something cute? Yeah. I know you love dressing up, so... What do you say? What would I wear? Hmm. Well, let's see. How about something bubbly and colorful? Something super adorable with bright colors. I know rainbow colors are your favorite. How does that sound? Alright. Oh, I got to choose. So we're just thrown into the game like that? A dark outfit that's... A dark outfit that's not my usual style, but nice nonetheless. Nonetheless. A warm winter coat for colder weathers. Winter fashion is the best. It is. A flowery dress that is the epitome of spring itself, maybe. A soft hoodie that a soft hoodie that brings up brings back memories. A cute colorful dress that always brightens my mood. A white elegant dress that seems to float when I walk. And I don't really have a choice. <laughs> anyway, try and move the mic a little. Um. Simple but elegant pearl earrings that go with any outfit. A flower bracelet that adds a breath of fresh air to any outfit. A scarf to keep my neck warm when the weather is cold. A simple black ring topped with a jewelry heart. A cute neck ribbon that adds a touch of youth to any outfit. Ah, this outfit. The day I met you, I wore this. I still remember that day so clearly. It was my first day at a new school. I was so nervous. Oh, I need to turn off the lights real quick. I was so nervous. I didn't know anyone. It was lunchtime, and I didn't know where to sit. So, I sat in the corner of the cafeteria by myself. No one even noticed. Not one, except. Also, I just remembered, uh, I don't have my glasses. Hey, can I sit with you? Oh, someone's talking to me? I really like your outfit. It looks super cute. Oh, thank you. What are you eating? Oh, um, it's just a piece of bread. Is that enough? Yes, it is. Don't worry. Honestly, no, but I didn't know what else to buy. Um, honestly, no, but I didn't know what else to buy. Hmm. You can take some of my meal. What? Are you sure? Yes, of course, haha. <laughs> I'm not too hungry anyway. Thank you so much. No problem. Are you new here? Yes, I am. Thought so, haha. <laughs> 
I was wondering what a cute girl was doing alone in the corner. Uh, oh, um... Just teasing you. <laughs> you should come sit with me next time. I would love that. Thank you. Again, no problem. I always sit by the windows, so come find me there. Okay. Oh. Since you're new, maybe I can show you around sometime? I can even show you some cool places to shop for more cute clothes if you like. I'd love that. Thank you so much. No problem. <laughs> Here. Key in your number on my phone. The rest of that day is a blur, but I was so happy. My eyes are getting heavy. Day we met. Just a bunch of dots. You know what time it is. Hey, don't be like that. Let's dress up again today. Hmm, let's see. Oh. Seems like the plant you planted is starting to grow. How about wearing something flowery to celebrate? Is it really growing? Yeah, it is. This is a cause for celebration. Okay. Something flowery sounds good. I guess this? Yeah. This bracelet. It's been so long that I almost forgot. I was wearing this the day you told me how you felt. We had just gotten back from a day at the mall together. It was supposed to be a casual meetup between friends. But all I could think about the whole time was you. After we left, you walked me home. And hugged me. And hugged me goodbye. Just as you always did. I was about to head inside when... Also... Okay, for a second I thought the game was muted. And I was about to throw a fucking fit. I was about to head inside when... Hey, wait. Please don't go yet. I felt my heart stop. And my stomach flutter. Yes? Um... How do I say this? You were fidgeting. I'd never seen you so nervous before. I... Um... You took a deep breath. Thank you for hanging out with me today. I really enjoyed it. I love being with you. I love doing fun things with you. It makes me feel so happy and warm. Your voice was shaking. Your fingers were playing with the bracelet on my wrist. Sending sending tingles up my arm every time your skin brushed against mine. I love the way your eyes light up when we talk about fashion. And I love the way you laugh whenever I make a dumb joke. I... I love how you're always listening to what I, have, to what I say. Even when I'm rambling and make no sense. You were stuttering over all your words. 
I'd have thought it was cute, if not for the flipping in my stomach. Did I read that right? I don't, I don't know. Look. I really like you. Like, romantically. I want to go out with you. I want to hold your hand and hug you when you're sad. Or when you're happy. I want to hug you all the time. And tell you everything will be okay. I... I know we're both girls and... And maybe you think I'm a monster. But... I'm so tired of pretending I don't feel anything. And that we're just friends. I want to know how you feel. Do you, um... Do you like me too? The look in your eyes when you looked at me. I felt my heart explode in a way I'd never felt before. All I could think at that moment was that you were the most beautiful person I'd ever seen in my life. My eyes are getting heavy. You like me too? It's snowing outside. No? Yes, look. Look out the window. Oh, the snowflakes are so beautiful. Ah, snowflakes. Yes, remember when we saw those together? Ah, I've got it. How about a fun winterly outfit today? To celebrate the snow. Um... It'll be fun. Winter fashion is the best. And I know you love winter clothes too. I guess I do love winter fashion. I'd forgotten how much I liked it. Well, it's a good time to get back into it then. Let's wear something wintry. I guess a scarf. A scarf to keep my neck warm when the weather is cold. I never really got to appreciate winter fashion, huh? Because I usually wear, like, the same shit, like, all over again. I don't have much of a fashion sense. This scarf. I remember the last time I wore this. That day was the happiest day of my life. Look, it's snowing. I looked up to see a flurry of tiny snowflakes floating down. Yeah, it is. It's so pri- I glanced at you to see if you could see what I was seeing. But all I saw was myself in the reflections of your eyes. And all I felt was the heat rush into my cheeks. You're not even looking at the snow. Your eyes twinkled clearer than, clearer than any snowflake in the sky. How can I look at the snow when you're here in front of me? The laugh you let out as I punched your arm. It was the most beautiful sound I'd ever heard. Ah, speaking of snow, though... I'm really cold. Should we head back soon? No. I want to stay with you like this longer. Do... Do you want to borrow my scarf? Huh? What about you, though? You're gonna get cold if I take it. Could try if you want. It's long enough for both of us. This is the same answer. <laughs> You spun around to look at me, your eyes wide like a baby deer. But they quickly softened into an expression I'd never seen you make before. 
an expression that could melt all the snow in the world. Shall we do that then? You slowly brought up your hand and lifted one end of my scarf. Your hand brushing against the hot skin on my cheek and making me shiver. You pause. And slowly press your palm against my cheek. Leaning closer. Your eyes never leaving mine. Hey, um... Is it okay if I... I felt your breath against my lips. And I craved you in a, in a way I'd never felt before. But... Something stopped me. What if people see us? Hmm... Then... They'll just know that you're mine. That day... Was the coldest day of the year. Yet... You were warmer than any scarf in the world. My eyes are getting heavy. It's long enough for both of us. <laughs> hey, are you awake? Nope, I'm fast asleep. <laughs> you are awake. You know, I've been thinking... You own a lot of bright clothes, but... Wouldn't it be fun to try wearing something a little darker? Why though? Oh, come on. Don't you think it'd be fun to try something different? Not sure. <sighs> Let's give it a try. Try putting together something a little darker today. Okay, I'll do my best. Um, this? No, the ring. I promised myself I would never put this ring on again. Yet, here I am, wearing it once again. I remember the day you gave it to me. For most people, birthdays are a day to celebrate and have huge parties. For me, I just wanted to spend the day with you. We were sitting on the sofa in my house, watching a silly slice of life anime. The best kind. The flashing of the TV screen was the only source of light in the room. We had swapped hoodies and your arm was wrapped tightly around me. Between the quiet chatter from the TV and the intoxicating smell of your of you on your hoodie, my eyes were starting to drift closed. You must have noticed since you turned off the TV and tilted my head so our eyes could meet. Are you getting sleepy? Hmm. You should sleep soon. It's been a long day. Hope you had fun. Every day with you is fun. How could I not have fun when I'm with you? It's, again, it's the same answer. Every day is fun with you. Your eyes widened in surprise, but then you giggled. I can say the same about you. Can you close your eyes for a second? Oh, uh, okay. I shut my eyes and a few seconds passed before I felt something soft hit my nose. <sighs> I opened my eyes and I saw a pair of button, of button eyes staring back at me. Button eyes and long furry ears. I I know how much you love bunnies, so I bought this for you. You placed the bunny doll in my arms. The fur was so that uh, was so soft against my palms. 
Do you like it? I... I love it. Thank you. <laughs> I knew you'd like it. Gave me a wide smile before bending down to fish something out of your backpack. Your eyes flickered to me, and you quickly hid the object in your palms and straightened up. Actually, I have something else to give you. Close your eyes again. I felt the sleepiness leave my eyes, replaced by burning curiosity. Uh, alright. I shut my eyes and felt your hands grab mine. And the warmth of your fingers as you laced them with mine. A warmth that was quickly replaced by a cool feeling on my ring finger. You can open your eyes now. I looked down and saw a simple black band with a jeweled heart on the top. I hate how slowly the text goes. It's a promise ring. I promise to you that I'll always care for you. And I'll always be there for you. No matter if you're sad or happy or worried. I'll be supporting you and cheering you on. I'll be here to wipe your tears away when you cry. And to laugh with you whenever you laugh. It's a promise that I'll always love you. And I never want you to forget that. I wanted to tell you that I loved you too. I wish I hadn't been so shy. Because at that moment, you were the only person in the world that mattered to me. This is gonna end badly. Because she said she didn't want, like she promised herself not never to wear that ring again. My eyes are getting heavy. A promise. Hey, are you feeling okay? What makes you ask that? You've just been sleeping a lot lately. Is there anything I can do to help? I'm not sure what you could do. I guess. That's true. I guess... Outfit time? <laughs> Alright. What ideas do you have for... For today. Hmm. Well. Since we tried a dark outfit yesterday. Maybe something lighter. Might make you feel better. Something lighter? Huh. Yeah. Maybe some white. Elegant items. Will help cleanse your mind. You know. I don't really understand the point of dressing up. Like this. Who am I to dress up for? Well, I guess... Yourself? You enjoy it, right? I did. Then, let's try it out. Something white and elegant. Uh, it's the only white outfit, so... These earrings... The memories are getting more and more painful. Yeah, this is gonna end really badly. Why do I keep doing this to myself? I wish I could forget that day. Yet, it's so clear in my memory. We sat at the park bench for a long time that day. I watched at least a dozen kids come and go as the sun slowly set behind the trees. Yet you never said a word. It felt like an eternity passed before you finally spoke. Do you like me? W what? I turned to look at you and met your fierce gaze that pierced my heart. Did I do something wrong? 
Why are you asking that? Do you like me or not? Uh, of course I do. He sighed and turned away, as if a huge weight was lifted off your chest. I'm sorry. I just... You've been so closed off lately. Like your mind is somewhere else. You hardly talk whenever we're together. You never tell me you like me anymore. You never tell me any of your feelings. At all. It's confusing. I... I really like you. And... I love showing you that I do. But... It feels like... You never show it back. I... I know I'm normally a confident person and... And I hate to let you see me like this, but... You... Make me feel things I don't feel with anyone else. Oh, hey, we're finally seeing the other, the other girl. You turned back to me, and I saw tears, tears shining in your eyes, and her. I hadn't realized that I'd never seen you cry before. And the stabbing feeling in my heart came. And the stabbing feeling in my heart that came after. I never wanted to see you cry again. I... I'm so sorry. You exhaled and closed your eyes. It felt like a year passed before you opened them again. You like me? Love you. You look down, biting your lips. I... I trust you. The smile you gave me after was so sweet, but... I couldn't ignore the pain in your eyes. My eyes are getting heavy. I trust you. It's not gonna end well. There's one outfit left. Oh god. What time is it? It's so quiet today. I guess it's outfit time, right? Huh? Why is it so quiet? Am I... forgetting something? Whatever. Let's just find something to wear. Um... What to wear? Oh, looks like... I only have one outfit left. Soft hoodies that bring back memories. This hoodie... I wish I could erase that day from my mind. The day that my world fell apart. And everything was ripped from me. You were standing in front of me. In front of my house, and yet... You felt so far away. Hey, um... M my parents found out... About us. And... They want to move me to another school. No. I... I don't want to hear anymore. I'm... Leaving at the end of this month. Your downcast eyes looked up at... Looked up and met mine. Your face was wet with tears. And you had a broken smile. I guess this is goodbye. I'll... I'll miss you. A lot. You let out a shaky laugh. Your hands are trembling. I'll think about you every day. I don't think I can ever forget about- What is this? Fuck off. I don't think I can ever forget about you. But... But I guess you'll be okay even without me, right? <laughs> Your pained eyes looked at me expectantly, but, the, but yet... 
I couldn't find the right words to say. <laughs> wow, beautiful choices here. <laughs> well, it's been fun. I wish you the best. You moved towards me. Your hot breath warming my face. And you pulled me into your arms. One last time. A hug that felt like heaven and hell at the same time. And your hand instinctively laced with mine. Before you quickly pulled away. As if realizing your mistake. Leaving me colder than ever. And you turned away, not sparing another glance back. The last thing I saw was your silhouette that burned into my mind and stayed haunting me for the rest of my life. I hate these memories. Last goodbye. I hate these memories. Every day. Everything I do. The only thing I can think about is you. I miss you so much. The past year has been hell. All I do every day is play dress up in my room, pretending that these outfits will distract me from my memories. Yet, everything I do always comes back to you. <laughs> I even started imagining the bunny you gave me talks to me and gives me life advice. Isn't that stupid? I wonder if you'd laugh at me if you could see me right now. But knowing you, you would never do anything like that. You would probably pull me into a hug and kiss my forehead and tell me everything will be okay. Are you thinking about me too? I don't even remember who I am anymore. All I want is to see you again. You promised you would always be there for me. Where are you now? The number you have dialed is not available. Please try again later. Damn. Uh. Oh. Oh, I guess I actually co Well, uh, okay, sure. Uh, missed call. Alright, sure. <laughs> Do I, do I reopen this? Is that what happens? Let's see. Now it's the same. It just restarts the game. All right. Well, that was a nice little game. 